Hello again, this is Adam. So, uh, last episode I finished my chicken farm, and at this point I do have quite a bit of food, so I'll be ready to start mining and or cave diving shortly. I'll probably expand my home a bit more later, but I figure I should probably get down to business with the whole uh, getting steel thing, because that's going to be pretty important. So, it's not right now, I'm just going to have a look around. Uh, I'd like to be able to use a lot of the feathers from the chickens to make a bunch of arrows, because uh, bow and arrows can be very useful while mining, and I'd kind of like to have some. Uh, you know, because sometimes just having a stone sword is not enough, and I don't really want to make an iron sword, because, uh, well, you know, that uses up iron, which I need. So, yeah, I'll just uh, fight some mobs for now, because it's kind of fun and interesting. Maybe I'll find a skeleton somewhere. Hopefully I'll find some skeletons or sp uh, there's a spider there. That's definitely workable. Try to avoid that creeper. Uh, okay, this could be a little harder than planned. So I'll take down the spider first. There we go. And maybe get this zombie. <laughs> Let's darn it, the creeper saw me. Well, so much for not being seen by the creeper. Oh jeez. There we go. He's dead, I got the creeper. Okay, um... Anything else here? I don't see much. Uh, there's some gravel here. I should probably look around back here. Maybe night and time's not the best time to do this, but... I mean, it's not a big problem, I hope. Just looking to... Maybe there's some sheep in this area? I don't really see any sheep, so probably not. Uh, okay, it seems all I've got to work with are pigs and chickens, so... Um, okay, it's just the beginning of the night, so I've got a bit of a ways to go before it'll be morning. And I don't really want to go, uh, work with the chickens when there's a risk of a creeper dropping. And speaking of which, I'm just gonna get rid of this one. Yeah, if you hit someone while running, you get really good knockback, which I find is useful. See? Um, that gravel is just annoying me right now. Stupid gravel. Um, skeleton. I should probably make another sword once I get home, because, I mean, I'm, oh dear, it has some sort of enchantment. If it's knocked back, I'm dead. It's probably not knocked back from what I can see. I don't know what it is, but I don't think it's knocked back. Oh dear. Uh, I have very little health left. Uh, but I should probably conserve my sword. I'll just use my pickaxe. Ah, oh, jeez, not another one. Um. Ah, oh, that's bad. Um. There's like four or five creepers there, I need to get past them. If I just walk through this area, I should be fine. I don't think, I don't think I've been noticed. Um, there is that zombie over there, and I think it's gonna see me. Nope, I think I've gotten by unnoticed. Yep, we're oh, we're good. Okay, that went better than expected. Actually, it went worse than expected, but it didn't. It could have gone worse though. So, All right, this is my gravel chest. My gravel chest has also become my dirt chest because I realized I'm gonna have a lot of dirt as well that I need to store somewhere. So, I figure I'm not gonna be like overflowing gravel most likely so 
this should probably be a workable system, I think. So when it's morning, I'm gonna start farming chickens. Once, and I already have like 20 plants, so that get, that if I get like 20 feathers, that will give me like 80 arrows. So that should be plenty. In the meantime, I'll like dig backward a little bit so I can make my farm bigger. Let's go uh, four layers deeper. One, two, three, four. Okay, there we go. Gonna have to replace that torch at some point. Hopefully no monsters will spawn here, but I don't think it's that dark. So it should be fine. What the heck happens with all my seeds? Oh jeez, not this again. What's going on? What the heck is this? Oh, come on. You've got to be kidding me. Why is this happening? This doesn't even make sense. This shouldn't be happening. There's no logical reason for it. Stupid bug. Okay, well, that seems to be the best layout. Um. Oh, my gosh. What the heck is causing this? Water is not flowing as far as I can see. Whatever. Jeez. This is ridiculous. Um, okay, so clearly this isn't just some problem that's in that one small area. There's like something else weird that's going on with my farm. I don't know what. Um, I really don't know what to do about this now. I'll just sort of just see what happens and grow stuff where I can, I guess. Maybe it's just there's some places where wheat can't grow for some reason. Maybe maybe it's because I'm indoors, that might be it. Maybe it's like if you're inside, the wheat sometimes doesn't grow. That could be it. Well, if that's it, I still have my pond farm, so it's not that bad then. Ooh, cool. Let's see. I don't think it's morning yet, but I can check. Oh, it is morning. Okay. Well, I can work with the chickens. I'll get back to that later. Okay. Hello, chickens. Let's see. Okay, uh, hopefully this all more or less works out. But yeah, I think that works, so we now have more chickens. Half of those eggs turned into chickens, that's an unusually high ratio. Of course, most of the eggs I've been randomly chucking around for this entire series so far have not turned into chickens, so that might be why. Um... Let's see, well, so far my pond farm is actually doing fine, and it's not, like, derping out like my indoor farm is, so... I'm glad I have this here, because it is actually working quite well. Put some more lights around this area. I should like look into the forest a bit more cuz I mean the chickens are not going to be doing anything for a little while cuz they just breeded so I can 
Maybe check out the forest, I don't know. See if there's anything good in here. This is like the sort of close to the area I spawned in, so just having a look around. There's pigs. Hopefully there's some sheep here because I really want a bed. But I'm not really seeing any, so that'll just have to be something I do later. Oh! Wow! Um. Well, this is useful. There's a bit of a chasm here. Was not aware of this. Um. Uh, fortunately, it's actually lit up fairly well, so I'm not going to need to drop torches there. Just like natural lighting. Let's see, where am I in relation to my house? My house, the mountain's back this way. So, if I sort of... I think it's back this way. I'm not... Jeez, I hope I'm not lost. <laughs> that would suck. Um... Oh no, it's it's over here. I can see it. I can see it. Um... Right. Okay. Ow. Darn it. Um, it's not that bad. Let's see. Let's... Oh, that's the place that I was before. That cave goes to my little farm thing. Um, let's see. Now there's some, is this a cave? Jeez, scary noises. Uh. Oh, it's a skeleton spawner. Uh. Jeez. Um. Better light this place up completely. Don't want to run into excess skeletons at this moment. Right. Well, what have we got here? Two saddles. A bucket. Oh my gosh. I I already made a bucket. Darn it. Uh If I had known this was here, I could have just uh Well, so much for that. Anyway, it, it should still be fine. It's not a big deal. So, I can just uh Hmm. Kind of want to be able to take advantage of this as a skeleton farm. So, I think I saw the Yogg's cast or someone do this. So, I'm going to try to Wait, I'm doing this wrong. Uh, here we go. Oh, this torch has to go, actually. Hold on, now this works best. Okay. Well, this might actually fix my arrow problem quite nicely. Um. Hold on. Do need to sort of get rid of those torches for this to work. Oh. Okay, and. Oh, jeez! Ah, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. This is going badly. Okay, get that, get out. Time to get out of here. Time to get out of here. Uh. There we go. Okay. Um. Scared the heck out of me. Um, right. Um, this might work. Maybe. Can he hit me? No, he can't hit me. Um, out. No, he can hit me. He can hit me. Darn it. Uh, uh, right. Okay, maybe this is not as effective as I thought it would be. Um, a lot of these seem to have enchanted bows, uh, right, okay, this is actually working, I think this is working, I think this could, this is a workable system, um, Right. I'll just leave this here for now. I, I need to, like, torch up a path to this so I can remember where it is. Um, house is this way, so... 
can just do this. Uh, I need more torches. Okay, let's see, what's this? Oh, that's the, I think that's the cave that goes to my pond farm. Okay, this works, that's sort of a, I think I may have gone a little bit overboard on the torches. Uh, this probably doesn't need to be there. Of course, it is to keep my chicken farm safe, so whatever. It's not the worst thing. Chickens are fairly important, so I'm okay with taking steps to keep them safe, even if it's a little excessive. Okay. Um. Let's see, so maybe if there are enough chickens, I can start killing some of them soon and getting their feathers. Because that would be really useful. Too bad you can't get the feathers off chickens while they're still alive like you can with sheep and the way you can milk cows. I mean, you can get sheep's wool. Sheep don't have feathers, obviously, but you know what I mean. Oh. Um. Okay. One of the chickens died of natural causes, it seems. Okay, well, I have enough. I think I can start killing a few. Okay, six feathers, that's pretty good. I can work with this. Um, are there any other chickens? Okay, no. Still, we have a good number of chickens, so this can work for now. Um, okay, things are really starting to come together. I just need to, uh, so I'm almost ready to go cave diving, which will be nice. I don't know why I'm paying so much attention to the Sugar King farms, because honestly, I have pretty much no use for that, but whatever. Um, where's where she cook the chicken? Um, oh, I have the cocoa beans, right. Uh, feathers can go in here, bones go here, the arrow goes here, and actually, I want the feathers so I can make some arrows. Let's see. Um, okay, this goes here, that goes there. And 24 arrows, that's pretty good. And I should also be able to make a bow now. Uh, string, I need, I think, three string, three arrows, if I remember correctly. Three string, three uh, sticks, sorry. Uh, so I need more of this. Where's the string? Here's the string. And there's my bow. So let's see, what time of day is it? Oh, it's night. Perfect. I can start playing around with my bow. And my sword is not going to run out of health soon. So I'll just take my bow and my arrows. And I'm going to shoot some monsters. This will be fun. Now I can finally turn the tides on those annoying creepers that keep popping up and ruining my day. Let's see, where do we start? Ooh, there's more feathers down there actually. I should get that before it despawns. Egg. Okay, there we go. Actually, I shouldn't open that at all during nighttime because if a creeper walks into that fence gate, that would be really, really bad. Okay, I don't really want to waste too many arrows, but... I won't hurt to use a few, though. Especially because skeletons do give some arrows back. Um... Let's see. 
Oh, there's a leather armored skeleton there. That's an interesting challenge. Hold on. I'm gonna get the spider first. Spiders are a bit hard to hit, so I don't even bother using arrows on them. Uh, right. Well, I've been going on for a little while, so... Actually... Once I kill this skeleton, I'll... Probably... Oh, there's those other skeletons there as well. Um, we'll start with this one. So yeah, how do you like fighting players when you're in water skeletons? See how unpleasant it is? See how annoying it is? Yeah, turning the tides on you, little boogers. Okay, there we go. I think I did a good job on those guys. They got what was coming to them. Okay. Oh, there's some clay here. Maybe I can dig that up later. Nah, I actually, I don't need clay. I don't really need clay at all. I should be fine without clay. Um, see, there's some more monsters there. I don't want to deal with all of them, so I think I can head back inside. I've had sufficient fun with my bow. Uh, taking out those skeletons was pretty fun. Oh, spider. It's a little bit too close to my farm, and I don't want this there. Oh, jeez. Darn it. Uh... Zombie. Okay, yeah, I'll head inside now. Once in, I'll probably end up. Uh, darn it. Uh, yeah, once I'm inside, I'll probably end the episode. So, well, yeah, this has been pretty fun. Got quite a bit done today. So, thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. And I will see you again soon.